Welcome to Boing Boing TV. I'm Shani Jardin, and I'm here at the Exploratorium in San Francisco for Second Skin. It's a fashion show all about wearable technology. Tell us what you're doing here tonight. I am here to do a performance. It's our idea of second skin. For me, I went into skin, skin on the body. What if all of those protective layers started to expand? Instead of one individual being, we started to become a larger being connected. I don't know if that sounds fabulous or gross. But these materials actually were left in a garbage bag. You're looking very trashy then, this would be a compliment if I told you that? <laughs> well, yes. <laughs> Most of my things can be worn backwards, forwards, inside out, and upside down. I'm here with Alice Santoro, who designed a dress that you can hear as well as see. Uh, Alice, what is this made of? It's made of audio cassette tape. Um, it's all recorded, recycled audio cassette tape. It's 50% tape and 50% cotton. So that's wow. why it, it gives it a very tight weave. It's very easy to work with. It was inspired by two things. One is Tibetan para flags. The idea of a, of a small cotton flag that's, that has an imprint of a sacred sound and the idea that these the wind would blow into this, the flag and blow these good vibes out into the world. So when I learned about that, I thought, well, wouldn't it be cool to actually have a, a fabric of sound? I love the idea that you're actually walking around in your favorite music and that maybe it's somehow emitting good vibes into the world. to me about what's actually happening here. Okay, well there's a circuit inside and it's waiting for a contact between here and here. And it's a human contact that turns it on. You can play music on this? Yeah, sure you can. Grab his hand, because otherwise it won't work. And uh, you can take part in the action too. Um, if I just hold your hand, and then you guys can touch hands. So you can see he's strapped up inside here. Inside here we have a 555 timer. It's a 40 cent component at your local radio shack. That's hooked up to make sine waves based on the resistance you put across two of the terminals. So I am a human resistor. I become part of the circuit. As soon as I touch this conductive thread, which has metallic fibers in it, it's connected back to the circuit. I become part of the circuit. And when I touch him, it completes the circuit. Why did you do this? I did this because there's so much talk about how it's not okay to touch in certain ways, and we want to tell people that touching is a really important part of everyday life. Human to human contact, skin to skin contact can be an on switch for your electrical gizmos. Boing Boing TV! Catch you later!